Is it true that Metallica isn't real music? (laughs) How dare you say that, Shred? In the hit Netflix series Stranger Things, character Eddie Munson's friends won't accept his metal cassette tapes as real music. Now, of course, it's just a show, but it is true that the world at large is skeptical of metal. Why do you think that is? Now, in order to find out if Metallica is even capable of making real music, we'll be watching a live performance of their Master of Puppets from Prague, Czechoslovakia, recorded on June 22nd, 2022. As we listen along, I'll be pointing out some of the music theory that my ears pick up on. Things like the keys, the scales, and the chords. And if you want to get on Papa Hett's level of understanding when it comes to musical structure, Check out my music theory course in the description below. It's way down there. <laughs> Knowledge really is power. This course is going to put you on the fast track to metal riff lord shred domination. Now, according to songfacts.com, Master of Puppets is a reference to drugs. Throughout the song, the master controls you and your life. This is evident in lyrics like chop your breakfast on a mirror. The master of puppets is pulling your strings, twisting your mind, and smashing your dreams. Drugs is the master, while the drug user is the puppet. Now, with that in mind, I'm going to hydrate my internal organs with this Wappian fluid. It's red today. Must be that time of the month. Oh, 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 oh. I just narrowly staved off a heart attack. Fortunately, it's all worth it with those 69 grams of protein per sip. All right, let's get to it. Metallica's Master of Puppets live in Prague. Boom, there it is. This song is a down-picking rite of passage. It's very fast. Be able to play all those down strokes isn't easy. And look, Papa, Papa H is even hitting some upstrokes. That's a really interesting lick. It's like a James Bond line cliche, but with an F in the bass instead of an E. And we're in the key of E generally here. Two down a half step, so it sounds like E flat. Tritone interval. I'm actually wearing my tritone interval shirt. You can't see it though. And the passion play crumbling away. I'm your source of self-destruction. Modulation up whole step to F sharp. I'm dedicated to killing you. It's my life's mission. This chorus is beautiful. It starts off with a flat seven and then it ends with that raised seventh, which is very classical. It's like you're getting, um, yeah, the blues influence and the classical influence in this one section. Smashing your dreams. Master. I am your master. Robert is my master. <laughs> Yeah, that lick right there is very interesting. Line cliche. Papa H. It sounded good. (laughs) Nice, James. Modulation. More is all you need. Give it to me. Chorus number two. 
Yeah, at the end there's that major five chord, the B major. And it's also like the D sharp diminished sound. Really beautiful classical tonality. Flat second degree there. <laughs> There's more like, yeah, the blue Sabbath, Black Sabbath style. Uh-oh, Lars has gotten off his drum stool. It's always dangerous. Sit down, Lars. down the dynamic level, boys. Beautiful. Wow. Pure sonic sex. So now we're harmonizing here and outlining this uh, kind of Andalusian cadence. Robert's laying that part down where you descend through the minor scale and end on the five chord. Gorgeous. And a rare uh, Papa H solo. Listen to how the crowd sings the melody. Unreal. There's Robert. He's kind of playing around, but he's also sticking very true to that progression, making sure he hits the root notes on the downbeats. Uh-oh, Bob H is going down. Gonna get closer to the fans. Taste them. <laughs> oh. I'm jumping on the choo-choo chug train. Toot, toot. We just went up a whole step to F sharp. What's mean? Master. Promised only lies. <laughs> laughter. <laughs> Evil laughter. <laughs> Go, Kirky, baby. It'd be better if we had some wah on, but uh, okay. Oh, dude, yeah. What a ripping lead. Get up there, Kirk. You gotta castrate yourself to get up that high. Man, little bridge section here. Good songwriting. You can't really get away with this kind of stuff anymore in popular music. There's that down picking from hell. We're going to hit another verse. Now your life is out of season. You're going down. I'll help you die. Got you covered. Obey your master. Do it. Your life burns faster. You're accelerating your path to death. Oh, that 
flat six course, delicious. Blue scale riff right here. Sometimes I just want to tug on Robert's pigtails. having a lot of fun right now. Triple six at a triple six fun level. Look at that. 69 million people all chanting for metal. Wow. Can you imagine? being on stage and just soaking in all that energy. Look <laughs> <laughs> Robert going to town. Robert really cheats on this riff, doesn't he? Because he's using multiple fingers. How dare you, Robert? Give me the chaos. Listen to that sonic chaos. I love it when Kirk starts cranking on his bar, on his shaft, you know what I mean? Metallica loves you, Fireworks. It's the fourth of Metallica. Now, give me your thoughts in the comments below. Is Metallica real music? And why does the world see metal in general as not being legitimate songs and tunes? Now, if you want to make real music, check out my Patreon page below in the description. It's the best way to reach level 666 fast. I've got a growing community there where we all take part in group homework assignments. We study something like the Phrygian Dominant Scale. And then we all post our videos on my page and give each other feedback and grow. It's about becoming the master of your own puppet.